watch at this hour the breaking news right now. Hurricane Milton is making a landfall as a Category 3 monster storm. Let's get now, go now to CBS's Jonathan Vigliotti. He is in Tampa. Good evening, Jonathan. How are the conditions there? Yeah, Nora, we're really feeling the power of this storm. Wind gusts easily exceeding 80 miles per hour. Just look at it ripping through these trees. Already more than half a foot of rain has fallen. There's a lot of flash flooding when all is said and done. We're expecting anywhere from 12 to 18 inches of rainfall. We're here in downtown Tampa. You can see the roads are clear. You can really see the rain as it rips through here. For those that have chosen not to evacuate, they're going to be riding out a storm that the mayor has called unsurvivable. A number of threats, obviously the wind, you've got storm surge, and then something that we have noticed, all of the storm debris from Hurricane Aline, which hit here two weeks ago. This community was in the middle of cleaning up when it had to drop everything. Now you got that debris, you have this wind, you have deadly projectiles. You have thousands of first responders that are here right now staged. They are taking shelter. They are not going to be activated to any emergency calls because of the threats that exist. That means if a call comes through is going to have to wait until after the hurricane passes. Meanwhile, 50,000 linemen from all over the country are here in Florida from as far west as California to help restore the power once the coast is clear. Warnings right now from officials that it could take several weeks. And when you look at this wind, already power outages, you can understand a big cleanup ahead, Nora. That's all right. Already hundreds of thousands without power. Jonathan Vigliotti with that new information and now I know going to take safety. Thank you, Jonathan. Let's go now to Vladimir Dutier. He is also in Tampa for us this evening. Good evening, Vlad. Good evening, Nora. As Jonathan just indicated, the storm is picking up. Hurricane Milton has made landfall. We are being inundated with water, with wind gusts that are now going to reach up to 75 miles per hour. Over in Fort Myers, Florida, where they are already dealing with cleanup from the last hurricane, 